Welcome back to Monster Hunter Stories. Today, we're gonna finally take on Fatalis. Now, Fatalis is a monster at the end of the Tower of Illusion, but we can also take it on from the quest board special subquest. So let's go ahead and do that. And let's see here. It's a question mark monster on this board. Ooh, and we still have to say uh, slay a Monoblos. We haven't done that or the white one either. We've got Sandberry off. We got still a few more. We got Rajang here. The end is nigh, so we have to slay the Dark Demise. This is in the Dovin Volcano, and we get two commendations for it. So let's, you cannot accept any more special subquests. <gasps> what a disaster. Uh, so I don't know why. I keep beating this one, but it never actually turns in. So we're going to abandon that, and we're going to accept this one. Now, let's go ahead and head to the Dovin Volcano. I'm going to make sure all of my items are stocked up. And the monsties we're going to be using today are Quicksilver, who's level 59. We've got Odin, level 73. Excalibur, 45. Boldrome, 87. Steve, 65. And Phage, 67. Now, thankfully, the special subquests are pretty easy to find. Now, I still have one for Molten Tigrex, who is just insanely strong. We do need to make a video taking him down. But uh, let's see if we get lucky and if this is Fatalis or not, or if this is actually Molten Tigrex. Usually, the first one I go into in the in the uh, Dovin Volcano is Molten Tigrex, but we'll see. Anyways, hope you guys all enjoy this episode. Thank you so much for the support you've provided on the series so far. Absolutely love this game, and I think a lot of you really enjoy it as well. I really hope we get the updates. Oh. Oh, there's Fatalis. Oh, it's beautiful. We got lucky right off the bat. There's a thing we need to do before we start this fight, though. Uh, we need to use some 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 cool mist if we can get to it. Stupid scrolly mouse wheel of doom. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. cool mist. There it is. Oh my god. Why is this so hard to get to? Now that our giblets are all nice and cool, let's take on this Elder Dragon of Doom. I don't know why we're going to take it on with Quicksilver, but he is our strongest monster right now. So we're going to see how this goes. Fatalis, the legend of dragons. Naya, ah, nobody but us could have this such bad luck. It's probably what he was saying. I don't know what he actually said, uh, but Fatalis looks pretty cool. Haven't actually fought a Fatalis before. We need to start getting into Monster Hunter Generations again. Really love that game. And we haven't live streamed it in a hot minute. Uh, we haven't really even done much of Monster Hunter recently. But let's see here. Let's see if we can get lucky and flash bomb it. How much damage is the tail sweep gonna do? Oh boy. Oh my God. Oh, and we have bleed. Is that what that is? Oh, he attacks twice per turn. Holy shit, Biscuits. Well, let's hope that Flash Bomb does something useful. I don't think it did. Oh, no, this is going to suck butt. Oh, I hope you guys are going to enjoy me, like, crying. So let's see how much damage Wyvern King Dance does without us buffing it. We might have to switch up Monsties here. I was really hoping this would work out for us. Oh, that didn't heal a lot. Is this going to deal decent damage? All right. Not terrible damage. If we boost it, it's going to be pretty good. Oh my god, he hits so hard. Holy shit, Biscuits. Okay, so we need to kill this guy as fast as humanly possible. Um, let's see here. If Quicksilver gets attacked twice, he's dead. If he gets attacked once, he's fine. So what we can do is we could do Wyvern King Dance again. And we could demon drug him at the cost of potentially dying. Oh, God, they're both getting hit. We might lose two hearts here. Spread Scorched Breath. Oh, my God. Yeah, he won. Oh, God, but he's dead. But he does do a lot of damage. Oh, he's alive because we won. Holy crap. All right, so he's going to use Wyvern King Dance again. And we're going to use a Mega Potion. Actually, you know what? No, we're going to... Yeah, we're going to use a Mega Potion on him. But we haven't been able to attack first yet. Oh my god, we did it! Christmas miracles do happen! Lost this head-to-head, -head, but that's okay. Oh, oh god. And I'm dead. 
That's fine. I anticipated that happening. We're going to keep going with Wyvern King Dance here. And we're going to use another Mega Potion. This thing hits so hard. Oh, the spread Dragon Breath again. Oh my goodness. That is just so cool. Oh god. Get all that kinship, bruh. All the kinship you could ever ask for. But yeah, I really hope we do get the DLC that is currently landlocked to Japan only. That would be really awesome. That would allow us to have Teostra and Kushala and Rajang as monsters. And I believe Agnaktor as well. All of which are amazing monsters to have. So we haven't lost another heart yet. And it's doing a technical or a technical attack, which is very good for us. Go, go, baby. Oh boy, two technical attacks. So we could ride now. But I think what we're going to do is we're going to continue with the Wyvern King dance. We're going to heal up again. And next turn, we're going to ride. We're going to ride on. All right, Tail Sweep is going to hit both of us. That's right, doing less damage now. Oh my goodness. Am I dead? Yep. That sucks all sorts of booty. So let's see here. Quicksilver is at 183. I think if we use Wyvern King Dance on the Dark Demise, and then we're going to use an Ancient Potion on Quicksilver to get him healed up fully for the first time and recover a heart. Oh, speed attack, you douche canoe. Oh, hello. And now, oh, we don't have the kinship. Sweet baby beluga whale. I was like, now we'll go ahead and do the, the ride on. But no, no, we won't. So we're going to go ahead and do a life pooter, right? It seems like a good idea. Get us both healed up a little bit. We need the better, like, group healing stuff. I've actually just blown through a lot of my items. Oh, dust explosion. Oh, and we have blast blade on us. Oh, there we go. Power clash. We needed this. Yeah, baby. Kinship up. All right, we're going to go ahead and ride. How much health do we have now? 524. So we're going to lose 20 or 200 from blast. We could try and fight it. But it's not attacking us, so there's no reason to. We're going to go ahead and use the kinship now. See how much damage that does. Yeah, because we wouldn't have lived through another attack. <laughs> oh, my God. Come on, baby. Take it down. One shot, baby. Oh, God. He's pissed off now. Great. Did we lose our blast blade or did we take the damage? I don't know. I think what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and switch out to Odin, maybe. All right, I decided not to switch out, but he is enraged, which is a little scary because he was already difficult to defeat before. Now, we could switch out to Phage because it is weak to fire and dragon. Now, Phage does have less health, but he does have kinship we can use right off the bat, and we can switch back to Quicksilver. So I think we are going to go ahead and do that. And for our kinship ability, we're going to use uh, Dragon Strike, yeah? And then we're going to heal ourselves with a well-done stake and pray, I guess. That does pretty good damage. Nice. And barely any damage to Phage with that dragon breath there. Unfortunately, we are... Uh, <laughs> Uh, our character's almost dead, and we have no more kinship again. So this comes down to who's going to last the longest. And Quicksilver has more health. So we're going to go ahead and swap him in. And we're just going to pray here. That's all we can really do. Actually, you know what? I could use the Vital Essence. Regen, regen a heart. I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to... Mm, no. Let's see here. We're going to do Life Powder again. Sky Force. Oh, God. Oh, that sounds so bad. 
Oh, is, how bad is this gonna suck? 189 and 193. Sweet baby Jesus. Okay, we can use Solar Cry or we can use Wyvern King Dance. Uh, let's go ahead and Solar Cry it up. Now, one of us is gonna die here. We could use Life Powder, but I guarantee someone's gonna die. I don't want both to die, though, so let's go ahead and go with the Life Powder. See if we get lucky. Dust Explosion is not bad. Oh, but it does give us Blast Blight. And then Quicksilver is going down. I kind of anticipated that happening. Did he even get to use Solar Cry? I don't think so. And now we need to use Wyvern King Dance. Thankfully, that got rid of the Blast Blight. Looks like I don't have Blast Blight on me. So I can actually use... I feel comfortable... Well, if I die... No, we're going to use the Vital Essence. And then we can use Demon Drug again. Because if we die accidentally to something crazy, we do have Blast Blade on us. Officially. But I don't think Fatalis has a lot of health left either. Oh my god. See, I knew I was going to die. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is so close. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. All right. Um, Wyvern King Dance. Now, Count Tagu is going to die. It's just going to be a thing. We have to accept it. We need Quicksilver to live. So we're going to fully heal him. And there's just no way to heal me up anymore. Come on, Quicksilver. I believe in you, baby. Let's do it. Ow. Oh, son of a beach whale. Oh, that hurts so bad. And now he's got Blast on him. I don't think we're going to make it out of this. There's nowhere to heal. I have got one heart left. And I have no way to heal my Monsty. So really what we need to do is we need to switch him out for something else. We can bring the Boldrome of Doom in. Oh, it's on like Donkey Kong. Sir Pigglesworth coming to bring us home, ladies and gentlemen. Can he succeed? Let's go ahead and use uh, Strike Guard on him. Because he does not have a lot of defense. Oh, and Fatalis is using a tactical attack. Oh, this is perfect. Go, Piggles, go! The Pig of Destiny coming to bring us home. Oh, God. Oh, what is this? Oh. The Pig of Destiny not bringing us home. Wow. So we're at about where we were before. Oh, my goodness. And we almost lost our first heart. I was about to say we hadn't lost a heart yet. And then that happened, and we almost died. So, things could have been... Actually, we have lost a heart. We have three right now. So, he's enraged. We've got three hearts. So, if he does something crazy, which we know he's 100% capable of, uh, we won't instantly die. That's, that's the hope. Uh, <laughs> and we have a Moxie gem this time, too. Oh, he was waiting. Oh, that means he's using his super penultimate epic attack next. Great. Hopefully we kill him this time. If not, we're about to lose two hearts on the next turn. Most likely. Which is, you know what? Probably okay. Um, no, sir. If he's going to use that super awesome attack, there's no way I can live through it anyways. Um, so we're going to go ahead and pop a moxie. Whoa. Before we pop a moxie gem, we're not going to do anything. Because that used up all of our uh, kinship. So we are going to pop a Moxie Gem. Dust Explosion? Okay, that's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I thought it was using his... Wait, or oh, this is the penultimate attack. Okay, there we go. Yeah, there was, there was no way to live through that. So we lost two hearts. We still have one left. Pretty much, because we can lose that one and not completely lose the fight. Now that he's blown his load... We should be okay-ish. So we've used Moxie Potion, Ancient Potion, and Vital Essence. We've got all of this left. We've got Surrogate Gems left, which we're going to go ahead and put on um, Quicksilver here. And then we're going to put a Surrogate Gem on ourselves, I think. And as long as we can deal some... Oh, is he waiting again? Oh, no. Is he just going to continue to spam this attack? Oh, that's just ridiculous. That's not fair. Um... Oh my goodness. Really? 
Oh, God. I swear to God, if he just starts spamming this at the end, how are you supposed to beat that? Come on, kill him. We did it! Oh, my goodness. That means we were really close last time. So that must be the attack he does just before he dies. Oh, my God. So 180,000 XP for defeating Fatalis. Would have been really nice if I had an XP boost on, but man. Fatalis is pretty awesome. So we've got Abnormal Jewel. We got Fatalis Crust, which means we could probably get Fatalis Armor. Oh, baby. So let's go ahead. The end is nigh. We finally defeated it. Let's go ahead and, well, let's see if we get any good eggs from this. Typically with the Elder Dragon eggs, there's really no special eggs here at the end. Yeah, so it's smelly for sure, and it's a late one. But this is like an Iodrome, and we don't, we don't care about no Iodromes up in here. It's smelly for sure. It's also 100% normal. Um, let's see here. We're not going to take that egg. Smelly for sure. It's also 100% normal. Ah, let's go ahead and take it. So, um, let's go ahead and head back to the village, check out our new armor, turn in the quest, and see what else is going on. So I don't think we actually get anything super duper awesome for defeating Fatalis. Let's see here. Oh, we have Snowfield Phantom. I forgot to turn in the Aroshi Kirin quest the other day. There we go. Get that one done. So that's 10,000 zennies right there. And where art thou... They tell us. We got commendations. I don't even know what the commendations are for. We did get 15,000 zennies, so that's pretty cool. Now, Fatalis armor. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Plushy voucher. Ooh. I like me some plushies. There we go. I like me some new weapons and armor, though. Ooh, we do get weapons for that. So, deliver Fatalis materials. We got dragon armor. It costs 30,000 zenny to create this armor. Oh, my God. That is ridiculous. So, let's check this out. So, it comes with 104 defense, negate continuous damage, negate sleep, and negate paralysis. As negative everything else, though, which is interesting. So, armor holding a dark force. It contains immense power, but in exchange, the wearer's sanity is slowly chipped away. Oh, my God. Unaffected by poison, noxious poison, or burn. Unaffected by sleep and unaffected by paralysis. Interesting. Then we've got the Fatalis weapons, which look freaking awesome. Look at that sword and shield. You got Dragon Guard on there. And then for this, we've got Ska Punk. Oh my god. 98 damage, element 8%. Oh my god, look at this thing. It's awesome. Reduce the enemy's defense to zero for one turn. Oh my god, that is awesome. Oh, we need that so bad. Hunting Horn of Despair. Those who hear it will we oh, become unfeeling beasts. Oh my god. That's awesome. So the Fatalis Buster deals heavy dragon damage to a single enemy. That's for the hammer. And then uh, the Fatalis Blade with Dragon Slash. Very nice. I think I'm going to use the Hunting Horn. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Plus, I like the Sword and Shield, and the Sword and Shield and the Hunting Horn are all on the same part. So I'm going to go ahead and accept this. I don't think I could turn it in yet. Yeah, no, I can't. So we're going to have to take down Fatalis a few more times. we will probably do that in a live stream or something like that. But thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And second, I hear any updates for Monster Hunter stories. I will certainly make sure to let everyone know, but I will see you all in the next one.